I just feel like a failed mother because I couldn't find her. It's going on 40 years. 40 years. It's a long time. For nearly four agonizing decades, Catherine Longo has searched for her daughter Jennifer, doing everything in her power to get her home. Seven-year-old Jennifer Martelis vanished on her way home from Shaw Elementary School in Tampa on November 15th, 1982. She was beautiful, long black hair. Then she was so tiny. She was like, you know, in the, in the classroom, how your children are like to have older kids. But she was the tiniest in the class. And she was so smart. They wanted to promote her to a higher grade because she was so smart. And I didn't want her to, I wanted her to be with her friends. And the day after she was taken, I went to her school and this little boy comes up to me and he's hitting me and he's saying, where's Jennifer, where's Jennifer? And I said, we're looking for her, honey, we're looking for her. There was a massive search, scouring the Sulphur Springs neighborhood on the ground and in the air. More than 1,000 neighbors showed up to help look for her. Despite that extensive effort, there was no sign of Jennifer. There has to be. There has to be somebody that knows something. Jennifer would now be 46 years old. Age progression images have been put out to the public over the years. Tips even leading investigators as far as Pennsylvania to search for possible remains. But nothing was found. So I keep this teddy bear with me all the time. Her mother clutches to this teddy bear her daughter's favorite toy, as she waits for the day that Jennifer comes home. I believe she's still out there. I just need her to come home. My arms are waiting for her. I imagine that she's married and has children and we're gonna have a whole nother extension to our beautiful family.